could post a picture of her looking good in her sundress, mm -hmm. looking all cute, beautiful, and bronze in the middle of the summer. And, and he'd want to slide in the DMs because he missed what they used to have. So I hit him in the DM like, hey, big I'm about to quit my job and be a nanny full time. I'm not a nanny. Because it's so cute. Why would you want to be a nanny, though? That's cute. I was looking at this tweet and it was like, when babies can't say please. Yeah, so they say peas with a little hand out. I'm done. Hey y'all, what's up? Hey y'all. Welcome back. So we're finally back after like, what, a month? It's been a month and I thought we were going to be a lot more consistent. But you know, life is hard and we get busy, so... Back. So we are back with tea with Bree and Jay on uh, topics that are like very controversial. Not controversial, but you see them on Twitter. Like, and they're common like... They're common like... Questions. Yeah, so... In relationships. Yes, and so we have a list. Of common questions and we did well Jalen did a poll on her Instagram yeah for the first question so last, and I want to know how many guys said what and how many yeah. girls said what so last night on my Instagram and I'm gonna see if I can edit it into um, the video later it was question of the day and I did a poll on my Insta story and it said is it appropriate for your significant other to be friends with their most recent <clears throat> ex on all social media platforms <laughs> and so 52% of them said yes 48% said no and I'm gonna go look like it had like 80 participants oh wow so popular 51 for yes and 48 for no okay so you have to physically count all okay so how would you you would say more guys say yeah it was actually it was more girls said yes is appropriate and then like I was surprised some because quite a few men said no but how I feel about the situation though let me tell y'all I really don't find it appropriate to be friends with your most recent ex on all social media platforms. Why do I have to be the most recent ex? Is it any ex period or just the most recent? Most recent because that's like the most fresh feelings. You know what I mean? And like you're dating me, but mm. my thing is. Why do you need to see what they're doing and why do they need to see what you're doing? Mm. I don't know. I just don't like it because it depends. <laughs> we just talked about this. It depends on the situation. True. Um so for example, hmm. when me and my ex broke up and he's my most recent ex. I did not unfollow him on anything, I didn't unfriend him on anything. Granted, I was the one who initiated the breakup, mm -hmm. so I don't know. I feel like when people feel like they have to unfollow or unfriend, it's because they still have feelings for that person and they just can't fathom seeing them on oh. that timeline of every day. But eventually, I ended up deleting him and unfollowing him because he was trash and he was just posting shit to try to make me mad. Um, so I was like, fuck you. So we just <laughs> unfollow. But initially, I did not unfollow him because I, mean, I didn't think it was necessary. Okay, it's not okay. Initially, I mean, I don't know because my ex ex, we're talking about like my three year long relationship. We were friends for a while right after we broke up and we were cool. But then like with the most recent guy I talked to, oh, he's someone. But see, he was being really disrespectful. But oh, he was. So um, um, in that instance, he should have been blocked. <laughs> yes. And um, I really, basically the, the most recent, he left me for someone else. So I really didn't care to follow him. I'm like, why the fuck would I follow you? Hmm? 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 Who left you for someone else? Toad. Oh! <laughs> I was like, wait a minute, no, he did it. Okay, yeah. Yeah, he um, did. He left me for someone else. Trash. Trash! The day before Thanksgiving, people. But, um, I really didn't feel like once he told me the reasoning, I was just like, what did I say? I said, Brie was there. I said, you're blocked on everything from here on out. Yeah, I was there for the entire conversation. She heard the whole I thing. I just, at least he was honest. That was one thing I can say for him. He was very honest. honest. Mm -hmm. But he's also an asshole because he's really, like, nonchalant. Mm -hmm. But, um. I was being so calm and collected, though, at the same time. But you were still into him, so in that instance. I was instance, so into that man. Yes, you should have unfollowed him. I was like, I unfollowed him instantly. I was like, you know what? I really don't want to, I don't care to see what you're doing with your ex. Yeah. Or and that was my thing. It got to the point where he was just posting shit to make me like. You can tell when someone's posting things to get on your nerves. Yeah, though. that's what he was doing. That's why I was like, okay, there's no reason for me to follow you. You're pissing me off. Bye. Mm -hmm. nigga. Like, I don't care. So I ended up following him and unfriending him. And also, when you do that, don't check their social media after you unfollow him. Or or, exactly. So after I deleted him, it, that was it. He's I gone. Check it. It's like when you burn something. It's like, yeah. there's no point. But I, check it. I really don't see it appropriate. 
in my current relationship, I would not appreciate the fact if my boyfriend was friends with his most recent ex. But they broke up. A month later, me and him start talking, dating. And I don't see it appropriate because we well, don't need to keep tabs. She doesn't need to see what you're doing. You don't need to see what she's doing. Um, my ex ex, he ended up unfriending me first because he had a new girlfriend. And at first, I was kind of which little, is commendable. Yeah, which is very commendable because at first I was just like, "What the fuck, nigga? Why are you? Why did you do that?" Yeah. But then I thought about it. I'm like, "Yo, I respect it though because." I don't want my boyfriend still being friends with his ex on social media. And that's media. the thing, like, I sound very hypocritical, but, well, actually, no, I know, because I'm not friends with any of my exes on social media. Yeah. Except for one, but me and him don't talk. Like, if you guys have no contact and you guys haven't talked for, like, And years. this is high school, like, so he's really not even an ex, honestly. He's not. I'm friends with a guy I dated in middle school. That definitely doesn't count. Exactly. In yeah. high school, though. But he was my first real boyfriend. Mm. But I don't. We're, we're not like that anymore, so yeah. I never deleted him because there's no point, and we're still cool. Mm -hmm. But, um, yeah, honestly, as hypocritical as it sounds, I would not want my boyfriend still friends with his ex on social media and still, especially interacting with yeah. her, which I don't have that problem now. My boyfriend is not friends with any of his exes on mm -hmm. social media, so that's not a problem. But if he was, I would not like it. Yeah, definitely. But I feel like girls, it's like, a, it's, it's double-sided because... I feel like as girls we have self restraint. Men, I really don't. Maybe yeah. I don't trust men. So. Ex could post a picture of her looking good in her sundress, mm -hmm. looking all cute, beautiful, and bronze in the middle of the summer. And, and he want to slide in the DMs because he missed what they used to have. So I hit him in the DM like, "Hey, big I head." I missed what we used to have, head ass. Exactly. You know, so it's just it depends. That's true. 